Hi, welcome to my final app. Um, so this is Catherine Lee, and this is my final project for spring 2021. About to graduate, yay! Um, and here's my video walkthrough. So we're stuck on a page that I was last working on, but we're gonna go down to the content view. Um, and this is my app. Um, it's called Good Night. And the reason I thought to do this app is because um, I explained this in my project description, but in my college house, I live with five, five girls and my room is the very first room off the living room. And there are many nights when I go to bed, I've got something in the morning, um, my roommates are staying up, hanging out, and um, things are pretty noisy and our walls are pretty thin. And so um, it's just been hard to fall asleep sometimes. And I think that's probably a pretty common story for a lot of people in college houses. So I've been looking for good white noise, sound machines, things without having to buy like the actual baby sound machine just to block the noise. Um, and so that is honestly something that's happened pretty often recently. And so when I was thinking of what to do my app about, that was the first thing that came to mind. And so that's what um, I decided to create my app on. And so I called it Good Night. I thought that kind of went along with the theme of going to sleep. Um, and I wanted to make it more than just a sound machine, obviously, and wanted to incorporate some of the other things that we've learned this semester. So I added um, some sleep tips. And um, I think for me, something that has never failed to do the trick when I like last resort can't fall asleep, or I guess maybe not always last resort, sometimes first thing, but I feel like I'm always trying other things first and then finally get to this and it always works, um, which is just reading. And so I added some poems under a little let's read feature. So let's explore the app. Um, I went for the more simplistic look, um, found this color that I made that I just felt like was a calming blue. I wanted everything about the app to kind of like give off a peaceful calming vibe. Um, so that um, a user can feel calmed by it because the whole point of it is to make you feel more at this of rest so that you can fall asleep. So it's very simple, put the little moon SF symbol. Um, so it says, good night, it's time for bed. You get to the explore page. Um, it says, welcome, can't sleep, you've come to the right place. Here you will find helpful tools to assist you in catching some Z's. Um, so we'll go into the first feature of the app, which is the sound machine. And similar to our jukebox assignment that we had, um, I just went on and um, found some different noises uh, that you might find on a normal sound machine or just that I enjoy. So um, we've added a white noise, ocean waves. Jungle sounds. Pretty good. Um, and something that I wanted to add to the app. Something I wanted to add to the app to make it um, go that 15, 20 percent past what I know, and to make it more challenging, was to put these noises on loop. And that was something I was researching for so long. Um, and so I found this property, went to storage, found that this is kind of what you're supposed to mess around with, but this was the part of the Juke Starter app. I used that as my like framework um, that was already done for us. So that was pretty confusing. But the best I could find was to go into um, my sound machine view and add this number of loops, negative one. That's supposed to make it loop forever. Um, it works sometimes, it kind of doesn't. So kind of got that figured out but didn't really um but spent a lot of time on it i feel like i know more about it definitely than i did before um and so that was my my main challenge for this app um was figuring that out um and then let's go back to the other features we'll go back to the welcome um the next feature i have is sleep tips so just use the scroll view for this and put a list in there um of just different tips. So tip one, this feels obvious, but don't drink caffeine late in the day. Take a melatonin, reduce phone use at night, read, drink some hot tea, change the environment, don't take naps during the day, um, and focus on your breathing. 
So these were just some tips I had that like if you were struggling and to fall asleep and wanted to be reminded of some little things to do, then you could go to that page. Um, and then the last feature is let's read. And I like this um, because what I did for it was just add some poems that um, kind of go along with the sleep theme. I just looked them up and added them in um, used the horizontal scroll view. So it says it's pretty commonly known that reading helps calm and focus your mind mind, which is often helpful when trying to fall asleep. On this feature, we've compiled a few pro poems about sleep to hopefully provide you with a sense of rest. Enjoy. So, I'm just scroll through, and I feel like if I was using this, honestly, reading through these sleepy poems, a flock of sheep that leisurely pass by, I honestly think it would help me kind of get us a little more sleepy. So I just added five um, that I really enjoyed reading. Um, and kept the whole app kind of along with the simplistic, um, happy, calming uh, color set, just white and blue, and um, just no crazy fonts, no crazy pictures, not a lot going on. Um, I also feel like that's just kind of my style in general. Um, and so yeah, that's what I did. So. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my app. Um, if I was a real, real app developer, I think this is an app that I would really love to make and help people with. Um, I don't have an app like this, and maybe there's one out there, but I think it'd be helpful to have something like this. It obviously adds some more little bells and whistles, but yeah. So that's the Good Night app. Thanks.